Four wins each in the last ten meetings between Dundee United and Motherwell. Would it be tight at Tannadice? Dundee United play host to Motherwell. On a crisp October evening. As Jim Goodwin's side looked to bounce back following that narrow defeat at Petodre at the weekend. So close to taking what would have been a, a good point away from the Granite City. And it is an unchanged starting 11 for United. Indeed, it's an unchanged matchday squad. The same nine on the bench as well. The last time we played Motherwell, it was a really close encounter. Obviously, we came out on the wrong side of the, of the result in the cup. They carry a real attacking threat. And, um, yeah, we have to respect them. But at the same time, you know, we're delighted that the game is coming so quickly after the, the disappointment of the weekend in Aberdeen. And uh, a really good opportunity to put things right. It's fourth hosting fifth with just two points separating these sides and there was barely anything between them in the League Cup quarter final a few weeks ago. Motherwell are looking forward to Sunday's semi-final against Rangers, so can United get some revenge tonight? We had a lot of control in the game. We had, you know, more goal attempts tonight than we've probably had in a, uh, a number of weeks. Um, we just unfortunately couldn't capitalise on it. It's a game that we should at the worst be coming away with a point you know it's just uh, such a shame to to lose it um, like we did i think the frustration from our point of view is just the manner of those two goals once again it's miller who clips it to the back post run on it by casey it comes to maswanese and it goes into the net he's been a threat continually in the first quarter of the game for united 22 and a half minutes gone and united nil motherwell one here's trapanovsky Squeezes the cross away and Dolby's there to pull at the header hole. And United do level. So first half we had plenty of control. We showed a really good positive reaction from going a goal behind. You know, scored a, a really well worked goal from our perspective. The second half, you know, Motherwell dominated probably the opening five, maybe ten minutes of the, 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 the second half, but thereafter that I thought we when we made the changes, you know, we were um, playing the majority of the game in, in Motherwell's territory. And um, you know, the, the second goal it's just it's hard to, to to get your head around it. You know, sometimes these things happen, players make mistakes. I, I thought we should have dealt with it earlier um, instead of letting the ball bounce a couple of times and you know credit to the Motherwell player he doesn't give up on it but it's a situation that we need to deal with a lot better. Harry Boyega is charged down by Maswanese who can run through here to Wanda Maswanese against Jack Walton and he scored a second of the evening for Tawanda Maswanese out of nothing it's the visitors who strike 74 minutes gone, Dundee United 1, Motherwell 2. We finished the game strongly, you know, we threw everything at Motherwell, full credit to them, they defended their box brilliantly, but it's disappointing because we've shown in games gone by, like Kilmarnock, like Hibbs, that we will keep going right to the dying moments, and we've had success in the past, unfortunately tonight we just never got the break of the ball.